Hi everybody, Diamonds by Tita here. Thanks so much for stopping by and visiting with me today as I do my post review for this beautiful colorful lion. And I want to thank Diamond Painting with Jack for naming him. Uh, she has named him Samson, which I think is really fitting. He's just majestic. I just absolutely, absolutely love him. So I'm going to dive right in into the post review, and hopefully it's going to be thorough enough for you guys so you can get a sense of really what it was like to work on um, the canvas. Uh, it is a 40 by 40, and it has 22 colors, and the legend is all letters. It does have the DMC codes. Uh, the canvas was provided by Fan Sales in a, a PR package or a product review package. So Fan Sales had sent this to me free of charge for me to uh, review and complete for you guys. So thank you, Fan Sales, for that. Um, so kidding up, let me grab, let me grab, I'm kidding up, there was no kidding up. I just used the little baggies that they came in. So kidding up was a breeze because there was none. And this is the first time I have really used baggies. Um, and I will definitely do it in the future. It was very easy. I really liked it. Um, I may not do like a really big canvas. Um, that might be a little bit more difficult. But these smaller ones, um, it was really quite helpful, I thought. And then I know my light's not going to show this. I'm going to try to catch some of the sparkle. He's very sparkly, super sparkly. I'm just trying to move the canvas around so that you can that you can catch it. Hopefully, I don't make anybody seasick by doing this. Um, but yeah, he's super sparkly, uh, and I enjoyed that. Um, Okay, so we did the kidding up. Next will be the drills. There was no static in the drills at all, uh, which was wonderful. Um, again, easy, easy peasy on it. There was some trash drills, but not nearly as much as some of the other canvases that I've done on budget-friendly companies. Uh, this one, I thought the drills actually were really pretty decent quality on it. Um... The other thing I just wanted to show you, I'm going to bring you in a little bit closer, guys, to his eyes. And this drill here wasn't there. It was black. And I put the light color in to capture the reflection in his eye. And then I changed his nostril over here. They had it very small, so I just made it a little bit bigger. And to me, it looks a little more symmetrical and looks nicer. Um, there was also a random pink drill up in his head here, which I thought looked kind of weird. And I got rid of that one too. And there was also a lighter colored drill over here somewhere that I got rid of and put a black drill in and I thought it made him look better. So that's really the only changes that I did. The canvas was sticky. Um, it was pleasurable to work on because the drills weren't slipping and sliding all over. Pull you back out. And then um, the only thing I would say is a suggestion if you were to get this, um, I would get a light pad because let me bring up the legend. There are V's and Y's that are in the same area that are both blue. So those got a little bit hard to see. And the other ones that were a little bit hard to see were A's and P's because those were kind of in this light uh, pinky lavendery color. But with a light pad, I didn't have any trouble seeing it. So I was just going to just say that, you know, you might want to consider having a light pad. Um, I love him. So I had a great experience with it. 
I love him. He looks good up close. He looks good at, you know, four or five feet away. Uh, in fact, he's probably going to look spectacular four or five feet away. Um, I'm going to hang him up on my wall. So this one is in the books. We are done. Thank you, fan cells, for this. And uh, if you guys are interested in, in this painting, I will link um, the fan cells website and the link to the lion um, if you are interested. And I hope you enjoyed this. It, again, it was a real pleasure to, to do this for you all. And that's kind of about it. That's all I've got for you today. Again, thank you so much. Uh, please consider subscribing or drop me a comment and say hi. Um, I love reading all your comments. Um, it's so much fun to do that. I like hearing from each and every one of you. So you guys go ahead, take care. Have a great day or evening wherever you're at. Remember, you are perfect exactly as you are. And I will catch you on the next one. Happy diamond painting, guys. Bye-bye.